involving a couple who were robbed at gunpoint of thousands of dollars worth of jewelry and cash. Miami police are hoping that newly released surveillance video will help track down the criminals who were involved. CBS source Peter Dench has the latest on the search. Peter, how scary for these people? Well, Ellie and Diane, very scary. In fact, the gunman yelled at the victims, I am going to shoot you, I am going to shoot you, give me your stuff. Now, it happened here two Sunday nights ago by busy North 36th Street. The victims had just dropped off a rental car in the area when they were confronted. We are considering these individuals armed and dangerous. Miami police say two lives could have been taken in this recent armed robbery. One victim gives up items at gunpoint. A suspect grabs them and takes off. Although no one was physically injured in this case, anyone that's willing to pull out a firearm and point it at someone is obviously a trigger away from actually injuring someone. So it's very important for our detectives to locate these offenders and place them behind bars. It's just after 6.30 on the night of Sunday, December 1st. Police say the young man and woman have just dropped off a rental car. And you can see where the offending vehicle, which is a white Chrysler 200, pull up at the end of the intersection, drop off a second offender. Detectives say the gunman threatens to shoot them, so they give up items, including gold chains worth $3,000, a designer purse, handbag, and wallet, $500 in cash, and social security and credit cards. A necklace is also ripped from one victim's neck. In the video surveillance, you can see the offender who actually committed the robbery is a skinny male, about 5'11 to 6 foot. Police say the gunman flees in a getaway car. They say the driver is a heavy set woman, and a second videotape shows her later at a store. The offender that is seen attempting to use the victim's credit card at the store is seen wearing a gray colored hoodie, shorts, and slippers. Officer Kiera Delva says finding the suspects is a priority. Obviously, our detectives want to locate these individuals and hold them accountable for their actions. At this time, it is believed that this is an isolated incident. Delva says police want to catch them before they strike again. We cannot do this alone. We're asking the community, if you've seen or heard anything during this time, you're urged to contact us with a little more information. Now, police say the skinny gunman and his driver took off eastbound in North 36th Street. They are both between 30 and 40 years old, and he has a scraggly beard. It is not known if they have struck before. If you can help police with this case, call them or Miami Dade Crime Stoppers at 305 471 TIPS. We are live in Miami. Peter Danch, CBS 4 News. Okay,